New at five, more COVID-19 vaccines are headed across the country. We learned today the government is now releasing all available doses. CBS 2's Jim Williams reports on who's moving up on the vaccination list. Innovative Express Care in Lincoln Park got 300 doses of the COVID vaccine on Monday and right away started giving shots to its employees who are in category 1A, healthcare workers. That's really exciting. It's the best news I've had in weeks. Uh, and it was a very uh, joyful time. Soon, Dr. Raul Kare and all other medical providers will have much more vaccine as the federal government releases all available doses, keeping none in reserve, to vaccinate those 65 and older and people of all ages with pre-existing conditions. Every vaccine dose that is sitting in a warehouse rather than going into an arm could mean one more life lost or one more hospital bed occupied. Officials believe with the federal government's announcement today, there will be much more demand for the vaccine now. The Army General leading the distribution effort says the doses will be available in more places, including your neighborhood drugstore. Still, meeting the demand for more vaccine and avoiding long lines will be an enormous challenge, says Northwestern University's Hani Mamasani. You want to be able to manage it to where you have enough people on hand at any given time that you're able to continually vaccinate so that you're turning folks around and utilizing the vaccine and the, 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 you know, the human resources needed to vaccinate people. Another hurdle, letting people know they're eligible and can schedule a shot. Dr. Kari told us Innovative Express Care plans to use their patients' records, then send out thousands of emails. We're going to use our uh, medical data to pinpoint the patients that qualify, and then we're going to send them a link saying, you qualify, uh, this is a password. We will give that to them for them to make appointments. Dr. Kari says he welcomes calls from his patients. Now, a spokeswoman for the Illinois Department of Public Health says the state is looking at setting up more vaccination sites and is working with pharmacies. We're live, Jim Williams, CBS 2 News. To find out when you might be able to get the COVID-19 vaccine, go to the CBS Chicago app.